welcome to my tech channel in this tutorial i will show you how to how you can create texture displacement just uh, what i have talked about in the previous tutorials was displace modifier you can check out my previous tutorials about modifiers and displace modifier simple demonstration showed how to displace a vertex group using displace modifier with one of blender procedure textures vertices were displaced according to the light and dark components of texture so image, image textures may also be used in which case displacement is determined by color shades in the image as shown in our example so just i want to open image editor just to open go over desktop i'm gonna be using this image as shown here and I want to make it using displace modifier and adding a texture vertex displacement may, may be applied to the entire mesh surface not all the vertex group textures have been defined in previous tutorials so prerequisites you must have an image saved on your pc to be used as texture i'm gonna be using this image as shown here to demonstrate texture displacement the image shown over the, here will be used to have the surface mesh subdivided creating plenty of vertices i'm gonna be showing you displacement using texture displacement is performed by entering texture and displace modifier to enter texture in the modifier the texture must be first be entered in texture cache so drag this uh, this tools over there so click on this texture so let's add a new texture so just i'm gonna be using then click on open go over desktop then click on this image in order to add it over there i have added texture so let's go back to the rdv part editor then so to use the texture for surface displacement it is not necessary to have it entered as a material the surface deformation will still occur in accordance with the color shading of the image as you can see in our example but the colors do not show on the deformed surface if you wish to display the colors and the texture image in the material buttons so go over here then new to add the new material as shown in our example new then go over go over color base so let's add the image texture click open click on this image to select it then click open image so let's open up the shader editor and here we have added uh, the image texture that I, that I have used in the tutorial it's over there so let's go back to properties editor as shown here so just i want to click on this adjustable wrench then click on add modifier add the displace modifier as shown here so just i want to add the click on this uh, button showing texture then click on texture to select it just we need to subdivide so just let's turn it off then i want to subdivide it just subdivide it uh, for example 25 times shown in our example so just you can turn it on 
and top to object mode is gonna be working like this as shown in our example the object's mesh surface is deformed the amount of deformation is controlled using the mid level and strength of sliders in the modified panel for example you can't change it like this you can't play around with these values so you can't change the mid level like this and you see the how affects uh, our geometry over there also go over here then you can set it to cycles just you can switch to rendered view to see to see this uh, structure so shift a to add the so just we need to add the point light drag it a little bit like this click on this uh, lamp uh, button over there so set it to 5000 like this or 1000 so let's go back to material material top in order to set our material So let's set our material, click on this uh, yellow dot, go over here to image texture. So click on open, just go over this image, click on it, select it, then open it like this. This is gonna be adding our image texture at the same time, texture using displace modifier, showing all the, this topology depending on the colors, as shown in our example, and you can see it like this because of uh, we tried to add the texture image to our scene and i think this tutorial would be so useful to understand what how to use uh, this space modifier also depending on texture image texture to create this topology and this displacement thanks for watching see you in next tutorials